You're listening to Earth Noise, the podcast that uses music as a vessel to travel through time and space. Hosted by me, Kelsey Georgeson. On this show, we will explore our collective experience by listening to a variety of music and finding a common thread. This podcast is recorded on the traditional land of the Kickapoo people. I also want to acknowledge that all American music has been influenced by the African diaspora. In this audio space, we aim to elevate the voices of Black and Indigenous people and their music. In this episode of Earth Noise, we're going to talk about winter songs. I chose this theme months ago, anticipating myself choosing these songs in the deep and cold of winter. To my surprise, I'm recording these in the Midwest on a 60-degree December day. Also to my surprise, I found that many of the winter songs I ended up selecting from these cold-weather places in the world were really singing about summer, warmth, and light. Maybe not summer exactly, but the cycles of the year. Take Silver Song, for example, the song you heard on the accordion in the introduction. This title translates to Solstice Song, and Solstice can be one of two things. In the summer, a day of perpetual light and warmth, especially in those northern regions of the world, and in the winter, a cold and darkness that permeates everything. Or that's how it should be, even if that's not the case this year. The text in this song describes the rotations of the seasons and, consequently, cycles of life and death. I've named this episode, Everything Changes and Time Goes By, after the translation of one of the lyrics here. This song, and seemingly the other songs to be featured in this episode, end up being about the perpetual cycles inflicted upon us by the passage of time. This music is from the Skane region, or the Skania County of Sweden. This is the southernmost point of Sweden, adjacent to Denmark. The text I will read is a rough English translation of what appears to be Danish text by Mia Keating, added or transcribed in 1982. When the winter gray is the short day, then the night is so great under the roof of the stars. When winter pale is your cold cheek, is in the living room the sunball fire carried in. And each time is the best in its own way. Everything changes and time goes by. While the ground is now quite cold and hard, is the den for the seed that will germinate this year. When the sprout grows and the flower dies, can it all begin where it left off before? And each time is the best in its own way. Everything changes and time goes by. As the sun rolls on the way of heaven, will it light a torch for you and me and watch your fire so it burns beautifully? You must know that it is now it is being used. And each time is the best in its own way. Everything changes and time goes by. Please enjoy this version of Silver Song as played by me on the accordion. The sheet music I'm referencing is from the Folkets Hus Spilfolk, a Danish archive of Scandinavian folk tunes. This music was released on this platform on April 25th of 2005 and was last revised on November 30th, 2014. You are listening to me play this piece on an old Honor accordion. I wanted to highlight perspectives on seasonal cycles from people who live with these cycles most intimately. And in my quest for winter songs, I actually found a song about summer by an Inuit metal band. The song Aliak, the Inukitat word for summer, describes the beautiful, endless days of sunlight and the glory of traditional Inuit food practices. 
The singer describes traditional seal and narwhal meals as wanting soul food. For more context about these food practices, I referenced a 2019 NPR report by Isabella Gomez Sarmiento, where she describes the cost of shipping commercial food products near the Arctic Circle. In the farthest, most north Canadian territory of none of it, essential groceries to feed a family can start at $500 a week. In 2019, a package of vanilla cream cookies cost $18.29. One bunch of grapes, $28.58. One container of baby formula, $26.99. This report goes on to detail how traditional regional foods, including the controversial seal, polar bear, and narwhal, are actually packed with essential fats and vitamins in high quantities that are essential to people living in such cold and dark climate. Because in the far north, food is so scarce, there is a history and a lingering fear of starvation. And because these hunted animals are so massive, there's also a rich tradition of community feasts and food sharing. A few things that strike me about the song we're going to hear. Despite being the height of summer, living in the far north is still so cold. In the video, if you're watching this, you can see it in the clear sunlight, the grayish tint in the otherwise blue skies, in the long sleeves and the heavy boots that everyone is wearing. I also notice that the pace of summer is different. Despite being this freeing time of year with long light, it is also full of work. I imagine when the days are so short in the winter, it feels especially important to make the most of days that are 24 hours full of sun. In this video, there are shots of fishing, meal preparation, moving fish boats, and of course, shredding on guitar. Content warning, there are clips of hunting and eating in here that do contain images of blood. One lyric that gave me pause in this song draws a parallel between the ways that we notice reports of criminal activity increasing in the summer and decreasing in the winter. You know, due to the, the ability to leave the house, longer days, no school in session, etc. Imagine the stark difference in this misbehavior, if you will, when the winter is eternally dark and the sun never sets in the summer. Just before a gutting guitar solo, this group sings something that translates roughly to, we break a few laws in the summer night because there are few rules in the summer night. This song is Aoyak, performed and uploaded to YouTube under a Creative Commons license by the Inuit band Slaves on August 26th, 2019. Featuring Ruben Anton Komangapik, Jim Merkosak, and Charlie Kesa. This video was directed and filmed by Johannes Minch and edited by Nicholas Longpre. Additional footage was provided by Ruben Anton Kamangapik and Caleb Sangoya. This film is dedicated to the original singer of Slaves, Roland Kesa. The documentation and sharing of this video was provided by Mobilizing Inuit Cultural Heritage in York University and was supported by the Social Sciences and Humanities Research Council of Canada. I hope you enjoy Aoyak, this Inuit song that tells the narrative of changing seasons and also tells a story about cultural traditions in a contemporary voice. Yeah. 
To close, I want to share reflections on winter songs as told through an English jig to drive the cold winter away. This jig is in a minor key while singing about the cheer and delight we create around the holiday time. As the lyrics aptly say, forgetting old wrongs with carols and songs to drive the cold winter away. Enjoy this recording of me singing to drive the cold winter away with Anthony Rideout accompanying me on guitar.
madly desire each other in love to read. Oh, grudges for God are put in the pot, all sorrows aside they play. The old and the young doth carol this song to drive the good winter away. Thank you so much to my guest musician, Anthony Rideout, for playing guitar on this recording, and thank you for listening to this episode of Earth Noise. I hope this episode brought you some new carols and stories and helped to drive your cold winter away. If you like the podcast, please support Earth Noise on Patreon. The sheet music for both Silver Song and To Drive the Cold Winter Away are available there, and there are many more goodies to come. All of the music used in this podcast is either public domain, available under a Creative Commons license, or has been licensed and approved for use by BMI. Thank you for listening. (laughs) 